Welcome to episode 4 of Sawtooth Motorcycle Tours. This video presents a few of the many photos from a custom 12-day tour that traveled through the provinces of Alberta and British Columbia, Canada with a two-day stop in Banff. Now let's crank up the Harleys and get this ride underway. Accompanying us on this ride was a motor coach, which provided an ideal setting in which to rendezvous in the evening and discuss the day's activities. Alberta's grandeur and beauty are obvious from the moment we arrive, with vast blue skies, snow-capped rocky mountains, and an abundance of farmland and forest. Following a beautiful morning ride, we stop briefly for lunch and take time to relax and enjoy our surroundings. Soon we are on the Harleys once again, proceeding towards Banff. Moraine Lake is a glacially fed lake in Banff National Park. The lake, being glacially fed, does not reach its crest until mid to late June. However, when it is full, it is a beautiful shade of blue. The lake gets its color from the refraction of light off the rock flower deposited in the lake on a continual basis. The area around the lake has several walking hiking trails which are from time to time restricted because of grizzly bear activity. The easiest of the hiking trails is the Rock Pile Trail. The view of the lake from the top of the Rock Pile is one of the most photographed locations in all of Canada. We spend the afternoon at Moraine Lake enjoying the spectacular views along with lunch. Following a leisurely lunch, we walk around the grounds, snap photos, and absorb the raw beauty of this area. Moraine Lake with its crystal clear blue-green water, a valley hemmed in by ten lofty mountain peaks, one of which is the third highest mountain in the Canadian Rockies. It's little wonder that Moraine Lake rivals Lake Louise in scenic grandeur and fame. One look from the rock pile at the lake's edge and you're hooked. The scene from the back of Canada's old $20 bill emblazoned into your memory forever. As I mentioned Lake Louise, it too is a beautiful mountain lake in the middle of Banff National Park in the Canadian Rockies. The lake is surrounded by snow-capped peaks and at the far end is a large glacier. The lake is quite isolated but provides a magnificent setting for a luxury resort, the Chateau Lake Louise. Even though we would all love to spend the remainder of the day in these surroundings, it's time to climb aboard the Harleys for a short ride to Banff. Banff was first settled in the 1880s after the Transcontinental Railway was built through the Bow Valley. In 1883, three Canadian Pacific Railway workers stumbled upon a series of natural hot springs on the site of Sulphur Mountain, and in 1885, Canada began promoting the area as an international resort and spa as a way to support the new railway. Today, Banff is a resort town and one of Canada's most popular tourist destinations, known for its mountainous surroundings and hot springs. It is a major destination for outdoor sports and features extensive hiking, biking, and skiing areas within the region. After a memorable day, we rendezvous at the motor coach to relax and enjoy the company of newfound friends. Thanks for viewing this Sawtooth Motorcycle Tours video presentation. We certainly hope that you have enjoyed this brief tour of the Banff National Park area and will join us once again to view other episodes. Visit our website at www.sawtoothtours.com. We'll see you again.